Crown Perth is working overtime with returned travellers creating their biggest ever room service orders and running staff off their feet. Busloads of international travellers are locked down across the country but some guests are less than impressed. It's fresh and free, but not everyone is grateful. Sometimes you get excited for dinner and you go to the door and you grab the brown paper bag and you're like, oh, geez, that's not what I was thinking. Yesterday, they forgot to give my partner and I both lunch. Crown's brown paper care packages delivered to thousands of quarantine travellers across the country and some rate the room service. I'm usually subjected to my own cooking, so anything's an improvement. But um, it's well-balanced it's well balanced meals, there's a lot of food. We're giving pork, we're giving fish, we're giving braised ox cheeks, we're giving, like, only fresh vegetables. The Premier hitting back at claims some guests are refusing to eat, leaving their untouched meals in the corridors. It's insensitive, ungrateful, um, inappropriate uh, and, frankly, pretty disgusting. Since Sunday, Perth's Crown Metropole and Promenade have opened their doors to 1,400 guests forced into self-isolation here in WA. The sudden spike in services keeping staff employed. It's a good opportunity for our staff to be you know, to remain uh, with us and, and keep working. 1,300 bags of food are prepared for each meal of the day across both Crown's Metropole and Promenade hotels, equaling more than 5,000 meals delivered to those in isolation every day. Crown says it's constantly reviewing feedback, but is managing the situation the best way possible. They are in their rooms for 14 days, and that's going to you know, create some angst and anxiety. And, you know, again, we will work through directly with our guests on that. But all in all, you know, we're very happy with the quality of food. That's really important, what's going up. Joshua Dawn, 9 News.